Today we're focusing on the F-35B Lightning II, a unique stealth fighter jet that can take off and land vertically, just like a helicopter. This aircraft is a true marvel of engineering. The F-35B is an incredibly versatile, multifunctional stealth fighter, excelling in air superiority and precision strike missions. It also has very efficient electronic warfare and intelligence, oversight surveillance, and reconnaissance capabilities. What's more, it can operate from short field bases and a wide range of air-fit vessels, including aircraft carriers and amphibious assault ships. This malleability and mobility makes it stand out in the world of military aviation. The F-35B originated as part of the Joint Strike Fighter Program, a visionary effort to replace many aging fighter and attack aircraft with a unified design that will potentially reduce the cost and improve interoperability. This program was a collaboration between nine international partners, including the United States, United Kingdom, Italy, Netherlands, Turkey, Australia, Norway, Denmark, and Canada. Additionally, several other nations are considering acquiring this impressive aircraft. Lockheed Martin is the main contractor for the F-35, with important contributions from Northrop Grumman and BAE Systems. The F-35B is a direct descendant of the Lockheed Martin X-35, which won the historic JSF competition in 2001 against the Boeing X-32. The X-35 showcased its abilities with short takeoffs, supersonic speeds, and vertical landings, a remarkable achievement in aviation history. However, developing the F-35B wasn't without its ups and downs. The program faced technical obstacles, soaring costs, and schedule delays over many years. At its peak, the development and production costs of the F-35 reached a staggering $200 billion, and over 3,000 aircraft have been purchased over the program of record. These aircraft were projected to cost anything from $40 to $50 million, and in today's dollar rates, each aircraft was estimated to cost between $62 million and $77 million. The first production model of the F-35 didn't arrive until 2008. For the Pentagon, the F-35 program often felt like a scary nightmare. The early years of development were marked by technical difficulties that drove up costs. In 2010, a non-McCurdy breach led to a comprehensive program overhaul due to the growing cost. Lockheed's delivery of the first production model of the F-35 was delayed until 2011. Relations between Lockheed and the Joint Program Office struck a low point in 2012, but gradually improved in the following years. Despite facing numerous challenges such as airframe issues, gun alignment problems, fuel tank susceptibility to fire, and the degradation of stealth coating at high speeds, the F-35 program remained determined even though it was faced with so much criticism for its unique size and technicalities. It was a massive and complex undertaking with high costs, but Lockheed succeeded in building a fifth-generation aircraft used by the Air Force, Navy, and Marine Corps. It also won in every global sales competition it entered. Despite its technological hiccups during development, pilots have constantly appreciated the F-35 for its beneficial and unique combination of stealth capabilities and data integration on the battlefield. Despite these challenges, the F-35B achieved several significant milestones. Its first flight happened in 2008, and in 2015 it was commissioned into the US Marine Corps. The UK Royal Air Force and Royal Navy commissioned the F-35B in 2018, and the Italian Air Force and Navy in 2019. In 2010, it became the first short takeoff and vertical landing STOVL aircraft to break the sound barrier, and in 2011, it became the first aircraft to vertically land on a ship. It also conducted its first combat mission in Afghanistan in 2018. Within the F-35 family, the F-35B is one of three variants, alongside the conventional takeoff and landing F-35A and the carrier-based F-35C. While they share similar performance and advanced avionics, each has unique features for specific operational needs. The F-35B stands out with its lift fan behind the cockpit and an engine that can swivel 90 degrees to direct thrust for hovering and vertical landings. The shaft connecting the lift fan and engine is pivotal and can be engaged or disengaged by the pilot. The F-35B also has a redesigned wing with much larger control surfaces and a smaller internal weapon bay to fit the lift fan. This setup allows it to take off in under 500 feet 
and land vertically in a 20 by 20 foot space. It also has a downward blasting fan that allows it to take off and land vertically. However, this unique capability sacrifices internal fuel capacity and range. In contrast, the F-35C has a larger wing and tail hook for carrier operations compromising some stealth and mobility. The F-35B's main engine is powered by a Pratt & Whitney F-135 engine, generating up to 40,000 pounds of thrust. This Pratt & Whitney F-135 engine is a single-spool turbofan engine with an afterburner and three-stage fan that reduces engine noise and boosts thrust by injecting fuel into the exhaust stream. Crucially, it can pivot 90 degrees downward for vertical lift. The Rolls-Royce lift system is crucial to the F-35B's vertical abilities, consisting of a lift fan, drive shaft, clutch, and two roll posts. The lift fan, located behind the cockpit, gets its power from the engine through the drive shaft and clutch, producing up to 20,000 pounds of thrust and also helps to balance the engine's weight. The roll posts on the wingtips provide up to 1,950 pounds of thrust each, offering control over the aircraft's roll and yaw during vertical flight. In action, the F-35B's engine and lift system work together for short takeoffs and vertical landings. When the pilot wants to perform a vertical maneuver during takeoff or landing, they engage the clutch connecting the engine to the lift fan. Then the engine points downward for thrust, and the lift fan provides upward thrust. The roll posts adjust their thrust to stabilize the aircraft, giving precise control over roll and yaw. The pilot manages altitude and attitude with the throttle and stick for safe and precise landings or takeoffs. When the pilot wants to perform a regular horizontal takeoff or landing, they simply disconnect the clutch that links the engine to the lift fan. This action returns the engine to its standard position, directing thrust backward. The lift fan stops spinning and becomes inactive, while the roll posts return to their regular setup, providing no thrust. This shift allows the pilot to use normal flight controls, ensuring smooth and precise horizontal flight operations. However, the F-35B's impressive short takeoff and vertical landing STOVL capability does come with some challenges and necessary compromises. To accommodate the lift fan and its associated parts, the aircraft has to sacrifice some of its internal fuel capacity and weapon payload. As a result, its combat radius and firepower are somewhat reduced compared to other F-35 versions. The STOVL system's complexity and wear also mean more maintenance and support are needed, increasing operational costs. Additionally, during STOVL operations, the F-35B generates higher levels of heat and noise, which can potentially affect its stealthiness and survivability. Nonetheless, the benefits of STOVL capability outweigh these challenges. The F-35B can operate from places where regular fighter jets cannot, like tiny islands, remote bases, or damaged runways. This expanded operational flexibility improves its range and its ability to effectively support ground forces. Moreover, the F-35B excels in various missions, including air-to-air -air combat, air-to-ground strikes, electronic warfare, and intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance tasks. This versatility makes it a formidable multi-role fighter well suited for joint operations. It's important to note that the F-35 comes with a higher price tag than other F-35 versions and most other fighter jets. According to the Senate Appropriations Committee's latest data, the unit cost of an F-35B is $135.8 million, while an F-35C costs $117.3 million and an F-35A costs $110.3 million. Additionally, its reduced internal fuel capacity and weapon payload result in a smaller combat radius and firepower compared to its counterparts. The F-35B can carry up to 13,300 pounds of fuel and 15,000 pounds of weapons, while the F-35A can transport up to 18,500 pounds of fuel and 18,000 pounds of weapons, and the F-35C can handle up to 19,750 pounds of fuel and 18,000 pounds of weapons. The increased maintenance requirements for the F-35B lead to higher operational costs, with an estimated annual maintenance cost of $6.8 million per aircraft. Despite these challenges, the F-35B has proven its capabilities on the global stage, demonstrating its readiness and ability to support Allied operations. Currently, six countries use or have ordered the F-35B. The United States, the United Kingdom, Italy, Israel, Japan, and South Korea. The US Marine Corps plans to acquire 353 F-35Bs, 
while the UK intends to procure 138 F-35Bs with 48 already ordered. Italy plans for 30 F-35Bs with 15 already ordered. Israel anticipates getting up to 25 F-35Bs with none delivered yet. Japan plans to obtain 42 F-35Bs with none delivered yet and South Korea aims to secure 20 F-35Bs, again with none delivered yet. The F-35B actively participates in exercises and collaborations with partner nations like Japan, South Korea, Australia, France and Israel. It has also undertaken combat missions in the Middle East, operating from both land bases and ships, including HMS Queen Elizabeth and USS America. The F-35B is set to be a crucial part of NATO and the combined air strength of allied nations for many years to come. It serves as a key component, giving its operators a strategic advantage over potential opponents and unlocking new possibilities in mission capabilities that were previously beyond the reach of older fighter planes. Besides its individual strength, the F-35B encourages greater cooperation and teamwork among the Alliance's member countries that either currently use or plan to include the F-35 in their air fleets. But the F-35B isn't just a military force, it's a symbol of the highest point of modern aviation innovation. This aircraft represents one of the most impressive and technologically advanced achievements in the history of aviation, captivating the entire world with its groundbreaking engineering and technological excellence. And that's it for this video. If you like this video, click on the screen to watch other videos like this one. Don't forget to like, subscribe and click on the notification bell to get notified when we post a new video.